Good morning to all. My name is Dhaviz. I am studying in the class. Today is 28 February. Every year of 28 February, we will celebrate National Science Day in our country. So, so today we will celebrate in our school. My, my project work is different of petroleum. This is a tank below 40 degrees to just LPG fertilizer. 70 degrees to wet chemicals to polish. 120 degrees petrol light cleaning. 170 degrees kerosene oil pitch stove, 270 degrees diesel oil, diesel generator, 400 degrees lubricating oil, lubricating gas, 600 degrees fuel oil, diesel oil, asphalt, paints, making roads, paraffin, wax, ointment, face cream, matchbox, candle, wash paper, plain solution. The petroleum is made in black enough liquid oil which are taken from the earth crust nearly 1 km to 2 km depth. The petroleum containing nearly 5 lakh items. Crude oil is a mixture of many different hydrocarbon molecules of a range of sizes. Smaller molecules vaporize at lower temperatures. So crude oil can be distilled to separate out the different hydrocarbons. In the distillation process, the, the crude oil can be vaporized and hot vapor rises in upper column. Cooling acid rises. Thank you. Good morning to all. My name is Sharan Teja. I am studying in 8th class. My partner name is Lakshmi Narena. Today is 28 February and we celebrate in our school a national day, national science day in our school. My project name is Types of Forces. The first force is magnetic force. Magnetic force is attraction or repulsion that arises between electrically charged particles because of their motion. It is the basic force responsible for such effects as the action of electric motors and the attraction for magnets for iron. Thank you. Good morning to all. My name is Lakshmi Narna. Today I will tell uh, going to tell about gravitational force. That the gravitational force is a force that attract any two objects with mass. We call the gravitational force. Attractive because it always tells to pull masses. It never, never pushes them apart. Thank you. And the large force is muscular force. In all the actions that we perform in our daily life, like brushing, bathing, writing, eating, driving and walking, we have to exert a force. Do you know from where the forces come? The force which we exert by using our body muscles is known as muscular force. Muscular forces can be exerted only through contact. Thank you. Good morning to all. My name is Zarul Shah studying in 8th class. Today is 28 February. Every year of 28 February, we celebrate National Science Day in our school. So, my project work, my project work is hydrogen gas and oxygen gas. Once the test tubes are filled with gases, take them out carefully. Test both the gases separately by bringing a burning candle near the mouth of each test tube. In the above activity, on passing the electricity, water dissociates to hydrogen and oxygen. This is called electrolytic composition reaction. You will notice the limitation of gases bubbles at one electrode. That electrode is hydrogen gas and another one electrode is oxygen gas. This bubble displays the water in the test tubes. Thank you. This is a hydrogen gas. This is a hydrogen gas. But what test tube, tube is bubbles come in? And another one is artisan gas. This is the hydrogen gas and oxygen gas. One test tube is hydrogen gas and another one is oxygen gas. The bubbles are coming that is hydrogen gas. The bubbles are not coming that is a oxygen gas. 
the right one is uh, hydrogen gas, the left one is hydrogen gas. This is come in bubbles. This is not come in bubbles. Newton, New, Newton described that effect in this part 
law of motion for every action there is always on equal and opposite reaction thank you